Hello, I'm Gamire and this is another video of Tesh Hard Pro. But this one is going to be a little bit different because this is a complete mess right there since I got three, yes, three phones. Um, first of all, this is an, an USB Type-C 2 main USB cable that, yeah, it's pretty short compared to, to like cables like this one here. Uh, that is actually pretty long or even my yeah even my note 9's default cable is longer than that the cables are not important but they are there for a reason they are there for a good reason as you can see there's a a case yeah a case can you can you guess which phone it is I guess I guess you could not guess it. It does not say the name or anything. It has a headphone jack. That's great. But that case for me is useless because it's not even for that phone. What phone is that one that you see here that is having the screen protector on it? The the uh, screen saver. Yeah, screen saver on it. Well, this is actually um, a phone that I will talk about right now. Yeah, right now because it's right here. Yeah, you see. Exactly, this is the Galas X8 Active, and as you can see here, it has the this epic um, transition always on display, lock screen, and then um, home screen. As you can see, this movement it has movement when I move the, when I tilt the phone. It's so much epicness right now. I love that, bro. I love that so much. Yeah, as you can see here, we got the different wallpapers. My goodness, look all these things here. My favorite so far, bro. Uh, it could be maybe this one or even this one. I don't know, man. They, they look so good. This is the infinity wallpaper. Okay. This looks a little bit worse on the <clears throat> on the preview, but when you see it, like actually seeing it, look how everything move, the transitions. Man, I like that man, but too bad that they removed that on the on the since the Note Nine. I mean, at least you could let it for the Note Nine, but no, they had to remove it. This is supposed to be a used. S8 Active, it is used, but looks like the the owner, the original owner of the phone, replaced the goddamn screen. So now the screen is no longer plastic. It's glass. It doesn't have the plastic layer. It's a glass screen. As you can see, let's see. Let me grab this Siemens Do You see this? It doesn't scratch. This is this is glass. So. That's a big issue for me. And here's another phone. This is the big issue that I has the that I have the with this seller man. This seller is the same one who gave me the S8 Active, and I I I thought that it was a different seller, but actually, actually it's the same. I I I honestly don't know how I got the same seller. Man, I'm so annoyed. This the seller name is um, Sooner Soft. Sooner, yeah, more like freaking stuff, man. This is this is the other phone. This is the S7 Native. I did not turn it on. Well, I surely did. I test the phone, of course, to be able to make sure that everything works and it works. But it has the same thing. It. it it does not have this plastic layer. The, the and the other uh, S7 Native that I had before, the first one that I had, that one has the plastic layer, but it was so beat up, man. It even had the pink lines on it. But this one is clean on the screen, but the issue is it does not have the plastic layer. It feels, look, the speaker. You see this? You see in this? Yeah, this speaker is sticking out it's not supposed to be like that this is the s7 native 
This one is a lot slower compared to the S6 Atif. Why? Simple reason. It has a Snapdragon processor instead of the Exynos. Yeah, the Exynos used to be more powerful than the Snapdragon on the past. So yeah, this is actually pretty good. Um, S7 Atif. Oh, you notice how it is writing? Atif, yeah, with the lower case letter. That was like that since the S6 Atif. But look what they did. <clears throat> Let me put it to charge here. They put it upper case on the A letter. So it says active with. As you can see, it has the upper case on it, which is strange. This one does not have the AT&T logo because this is actually, apart from being the last active, um, Samsung, what they did is to have the S8 Atif be available not only for AT&T but for other carriers but I got the AT&T version because I mean the other ones are AT&T like come on it has to, to look uh, very consistent you see this this is the A10 box right well guess what oh man this is the A50 actually yeah I got the Galaxy A50 my goodness go there you go yeah, very shiny back. Look at that shiny. Mm, man, looking great there. Yeah, looking really, really good. But mm, here's the thing. Um, the phone is very low on battery, by the way. That's why you see those ca the, the cables. Uh, I forgot to bring it up. And my aunt currently which it was the original owner of this A50 she got the I lent her my A6 Active so she can use a phone uh, before buying the next one she's going to buy the P, the Huawei P30 Pro I mean P30 Lite actually and no this phone I'm not going to use it for a week maybe I, I will actually use it because here's something epic yeah under display unlocking look at this oh my goodness it's not very consistent so many people criticize that here's another thing that's so epic about it you see this man ultra wide camera i never had this before it looks very funny <clears throat> you can get everything on the shot no, this one is darker. No, this one is with the with the with the um with the bokeh thread with the light focus. But here's another thing. I want this on my Note 9. You see? Zoom. Oh man, they look so funny. So yeah, it is actually pretty epic. And then this phone um <clears throat> is basically a Galaxy S10, say the reviews. Because it's, I mean, it has the under display fingerprint scanning. It has uh, three cameras. Okay, the aesthetic of having three cameras. But actually, here's the thing. So as you can see here, this is the ultra wide main and the focus. There is no telephoto camera, unfortunately. Oh, and of course, there's the flash. Shiny, shiny back, bro. So. Man, I want to use this phone just because of the back and because of the other feature being like a Galaxy S10, like, oh my goodness, look at that epicness right there. Uh, under display figure pre scan, I never had this before. Oh my goodness, so much epicness. So yeah, that's, that's about it, about everything. So yeah, I got all the Galaxy S active. And I'm going to do a very epic video about it later. But I gotta get the S6 Active back. So let's just wait another week or another, 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 another week to get the S6 Active. So yeah, that's about everything that I had to say. And thank you for watching this video. Subscribe for more content like this. Look at the always on display. Man, always on display, man. 
every phone has it now. Every phone will get it. Always on displays. Always on displays.